All right, back from therapy. It went well. I like her. Anyway, Dana's oh, got an appointment. Yeah, there's some movie with Kevin Klein and Meryl Streep. She's young as fuck. And I don't know his name. Anyway, Dana's got a, um, an appointment. I told him last night. She was very anxious last night. Yup. <laughs> you know. So, uh, we're going to go and get some Starbucks. Starbies. Mm -hmm. And then just chill out for a while before yeah. our appointment. Yep. So, we'll see in the car. All right. Back from therapy. It went well. I like her. So, I have a little grocery haul. There isn't much, but we just got home. We're hungry. I have gloves on because I was just washing dishes. I don't want to ruin my nails. Let me show you what I got. Not much, like I said. Uh... Just some romaine, two two of these iceberg lettuce, uh, crushed tomatoes, $1.69. Um, I need some more hydration in my face, like thick hydration. So I bought that. These were on sale 10 for 10. And then these were like on clearance, and I'm on a salad kick lately. So I got two of them for $1.73 a piece. And then another thing of this. There's the other iceberg and a thing of kale. That's pretty much it. So we're gonna eat, we're having tuna. I am really exhausted from therapy today. I was gonna talk to you guys about it, but I don't even know if I have the mental energy to do that right now. It, I'm just, I'm tired. I'm tired and I wanna tell you guys all about it but I want to tell you all about it, not just bits and pieces. So, tomorrow might be a better day for me to do that because I'm not really all in right now. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not really feeling it right now. It's a long, dragged out story um, that happened with my first therapist that I was seeing for eight months, and I had to not see her anymore I had to pretty much fire her <laughs> I mean kind of it's kind of how you put it I wouldn't say fire but I just I no longer needed her services there's that and I needed to find somebody new somebody who meshed with me a little better and was just more professional so I'm gonna make uh, some food for myself um, Austin and Samantha already ate, but she didn't eat a lot. I don't know. I guess she wasn't hungry. But I'm gonna make us all um, like a crunch wrap. Well, Austin's having his on a roll, but myself and Arlo, we are having um, some of my dad's roast beef that he gave me. I showed you guys yesterday, I think it was. Um, some of the roast beef that he gave me, and uh, I'm gonna slice it up or thin. And I'm going to put it inside some cut the carb and make like a crunch wrap with some homemade uh, potato wedges in the oven and a side of broccoli. We were going to order something, but it's really expensive. And I just can't see ordering when I have food in my house. As much as it's a convenience for me and it's a wonderful thing that I don't have to cook it, it's just too fucking expensive. And I'm not willing to spend that much money on one meal even out of convenience. So I'm gonna make some food, I'll show you what it looks like afterwards. I'm very fucking tired right now. I can barely stand up, I'm so tired. I'm gonna make some coffee because a bitch needs some coffee. So I will talk to you guys later. And these are blue light glasses. I'm actually waiting for my actual glasses to be finished and ready at the eye place, like the glass glasses place. We had our eyes checked 
I don't know, a month ago? Arlo got her glasses, but I did not get mine, and I'm still waiting. So hopefully they call before Friday. So I've been into Today listening to podcasts, <laughs> and Arlo told me and so now I'm about like this I one. And I'm looking around, I'm like, Let me pause her. What, what happened? So it's called Unfuck Your Brain, and I fucking love it so much. All right, here's dinner. Um, this inside here, this is cut the carb. It is a, um, it's like a fake chicken sandwich. It's made by Morningstar. So I've got two of those in there with a little bit of cheese, homemade uh, like oven fries, and then some green beans. That's dinner. Good morning. This is what I woke up to. Do you hear that? It's beautiful. This is on YouTube, by the way. And if you don't, all you have to do is look up like cozy fireplace or cozy nights or whatever. And you can actually um, just listen to it all day. There's like 20 hours of it. There's all kinds of shit. Anyway, so I liked it. I'm, there's no sun out today. It's uh, a dreary ass day. I'm telling you, we get the sun for a day and then clouds for 10 days. So that's usually how it works here in this fucking state. There's the dogs. Yep. Yep. -ity -yep. Oop. Almost fell. Yeah. So look at that. You see that? Fucking dogs. Gotta lift this up. Dreary ass day. Oh, let me show you. I have to clean it, but so this is the new cage and it looks just like this one, but that part is a little bigger than that part. But we're going to take off a panel here and there's going to be like a ramp that they can jump on and off, you know, to go in each cage. And this gives them, cause there's four girls, gives them the entire thing to run around in, which I love. Serena. Serena, you ready, girl? You're ready to be with your sissies? Serena. Serena Joy, answer me now. Yeah, so that's the plan. All right, I am making a cani salad, which is imitation crab meat, um, cucumber, sriracha, kewpie mayo, which I don't have, but I have to make. Um, I'm going to add a little bit of this, too salt and white pepper yeah exciting okay so this is what the cage looks like now so this is one cage this is the other as you can see the top part is bigger on this side than it is on this side but they enter through the ramp up and down and they have this entire area Sonia what do you think what do you think She's like, um, I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Uh, so yeah. And then Millie and Serena are in there. Yeah. So she hasn't ventured out into that area yet. I don't think she knows how to get over the thing yet. So yeah, that's it. I'm still here. <laughs> I ha Oh, I always come on here looking red as fuck. But I'm trying. Oh, hell. Oh, damn. I done fucked up. Hold, please. I'm trying to get Chloe's medicine together so I can give it to her, but, you know, here we are making a fucking mess. I don't even know where that bill went. Jesus Christ. Sorry. What the fuck, dude? I'm missing a pill. There it is. You're looking up at the sky. See? Here's my fact. I have all these fucking pills. Look. These are her pills. Come and get your medicine. I'm gonna give it to her with cheese. Come on. Yeah, so I made another salad, I know. I just keep showing you the same fucking meal. I swear I eat different things, but I've, I'm, ooh. I, this has a choke hold on me, so it's just like grilled chicken and pickled onions and mixed greens and lemon juice and olive oil and tomatoes. And then I'm going to add some pumpkin seeds to it because that adds crunch. And then I'm going to go stuff my face with it because I want that crunch. Anyway, 
I'm gonna talk to you guys about my anxiety situation and why I had to seek out a therapist and then what happened with my first therapist and then why I had to seek out a second one which would be the reason why I had to seek out I mean why it would be the reason why I don't have the other therapist so when I'm done eating I'm gonna bring you guys in the room and uh, we're gonna have a little heart to hurt oh good morning I it's bright in here why so bright in here hold on it's just too bright I, I can't Oh, now it's too dark. You know what? I'm over it. It's 6.16 on Friday. February 9th. Is it the 9th? Let me look. 10th? 10th? Uh-huh. 10th. Yeah, whatever. So that means yesterday when I was talking with my anxiety um, about my new therapist I went to go see her on the 8th not the 7th so let's clear that up right now <laughs> I am gonna make coffee is there water in here yes I'm gonna make some coffee well sir <sighs> my dad just dropped off some bagels so that'll be a nice little treat so, we'll probably have one of those for breakfast with some eggs or something. Obviously, we're going to have it with eggs. Um, yeah, so I'm going to make coffee. Bitch really needs some coffee. And I need to learn how to hold you guys out further because sometimes it's real close and personal. It's just too close. Um, you know, the only shit we love, the Colombian, is the best best ever so let me I'm gonna try to scoop scoop this in here without making a freaking mess I don't know is it possible it's possible I also I'm gonna feed the dog I feed the cat Whoa. I'm so sorry for yawning so much but I'm tired I'm gonna use my little that mug I do three and a half pumps because I feel like that's plenty and then we just you know we hit the magic button I'm gonna feed the animals right now and yeah so hold on it is we're waiting for that to stop doing that you'll hear the oh and I give this to them every single day um, along with she takes a lot of meds um, and then that's that that was the that was the sign um, yeah because we already know she has hip issues so and then I give it to Rico because he's actually getting older he's a year older than her so it doesn't definitely doesn't hurt to give it to him so she gets three, he gets two because of the weight, and I'm going to give it to them right now. 